So what up guys, what up? So I'm actually supposed to actually go to the gym today. I'm just knocking my door. It's, it's just so awkward. I have actually never done a vlog before or a video log, whatever they call it. I've never done one of these before at all. Um, because I'm just not really good at speaking in front of the camera and stuff like that. So I've never really done one before. I'm actually using my iPhone right now to record this video. I'm just very very fidgety. Okay, I would double check my door like five times before I leave Because I'm so paranoid about leaving my door open. So basically I'm supposed to go to the gym I feel really sad because my whole team at any good life right now They're praying and they're doing all the preparation stuff for the conference, which is the one thing 16 So I'm gonna go there now actually and help them a little bit Then I'm gonna hit the gym after and I'm gonna come home and sleep because I work tomorrow morning at 7 45 a.m so i'm actually walking right now to the bus stop to take the ttc which is the toronto transit company um public transportation um sorry my hands on the camera okay so pretty much i sold my car recently um so i don't have a car right now so i'm busting it and i decided not to buy a new one because i will be going to school downtown which is rising and it's in the middle it's like a metropolitan area so it's like really highly populated and driving is not the best way to go i think transit would be the best way for me to go so i'm actually like doing with a living with a car for the next two to three years i hope that i do survive because i really don't like public transportation but i'm gonna have to use the public transportation for the next couple of years so i better get used to it Right now I'm actually on the bus, making my way to the Animal Life Service, then to gym. Hopefully I make it to gym. So guys, you won't believe what happened. Like I was actually on my way right now to the to the um the priors to the group session, and I saw a guy on the bus catching a Pikachu. And I'm saying to myself, like, I gotta catch a Pikachu. <laughs> so I ran all around trying to catch a Pikachu, and in the end, I didn't catch the Pikachu, which makes me really, really sad. Um, I haven't catched Charizard yet, uh, nor Dragonite. Dragonite, 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 okay, whatever that thing is. <laughs> and those are like the top Pokemons I catch. The Drowsies, wait, Drowsies are everywhere, sorry. Drowsies are everywhere in my neighborhood. Um, yeah, I catch a lot of Pokemon, but I just want the Pikachu. I don't care if Pikachu is not like the best Pokemon. I want Pikachu. So, hey guys. I actually just came back from, sorry, I actually just came back from Priors and praying and all that. And it's kind of late. Like, it's really, really late. Now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to not go to the gym today. Yeah, honestly, I procrastinate more than anyone else I ever know. And I don't want to, like, go to bed late or something so and then I can't wake up tomorrow morning and then I can't go to work and uh, yeah so I decided not to go to the gym but actually you know what since I'm here and since I'm talking to you guys and since you're all listening like actually not listening you're all watching technically okay since you're all here and you're all watching and everything like that very it's been very hard for me to decide on a laptop because actually i need a new laptop because my laptop has been like i've been had that laptop since like 2012 so it's like for 2016 now it's like four and a half five years old i guess okay but i need a new laptop i need a new laptop guys like the laptop is just it's old like you know it's ancient of days it's like old so um i've been deciding um i want to get a macbook um i looked at the macbook pro um excited about it but then i realized that hey there might be a new macbook pro that's coming out the 2016 model and they have the 2015 model right now the apple store um they give away a free beats headset with it and all that stuff so i'm like excited about it but i want to wait for the new macbook that's going to come out which is a 2016 model macbook because that one supposedly had some kind of um new touch i don't know some led touch thing for like the f1 keys and stuff like that or something like that i don't know i don't know what it's called or whatnot because i'm not really that computer tech savvy but um i'm thinking about like, just waiting and get that one because yeah, i don't want to get the new one and then 
2051 and like a 2061 come out. I'm like, oh my god, I shall wait and check out the 2061. So now I'm like indecisive. Like I don't know what to do. So what do you guys think? Do you guys think I should actually wait for the 2016 model MacBook Pro, or do you think I should just get the 2015 model? Like I don't know what to choose. Like seriously, this is so hard. So I don't know. Let me know. Comment. Whatever. Um, just let me know what you think. Still. Good morning. So I'm actually really excited about going to work this morning. Wait, what's that on my lip? Mm -hmm. Okay. So guys, I'm actually really excited about going to work this morning. I'm going to work right now as we speak. Um, yeah. So it's going to be swim day today at work. So the kids want to go out and swim and do all that fun stuff. And I'm actually late. Well, technically I'm late because... Usually, like, usually there's like, I don't know, the bus is like crazy in Toronto. There's like two buses I can catch. It's like, there's the first one that like literally gets me there like five minutes early or ten minutes early. And there's one that gets me there like almost like right on the dot or maybe two or three minutes late. Which is not, it's not too, too bad. Sorry, I was just checking to see if that was my bus actually. Right now, we're actually at the Any Good Life. Um, you know, we're just preparing for the 116 conference. You know what I mean? So I'm here with the boys. You know what I'm saying. So right now, I'm about to you know go on some food right now. We got Nadine serving the food right here. Hello. So in a bit, I'm about to head home. Looks like Jim is not gonna go down today. I'm on my way home now, the street is tired, on the bus, um, it's been a good day, very busy one, but So what up people, so I'm back home, you know, just came from church and all that, praying and all that, and now you know I'm back home now, so it was a good day. Good day. Can't complain. Had fun at work and not home. Okay. Jesus, I'm coming true. So you, my destiny is around to one of my best. 
what's up guys how you doing so i'm actually back from the any good life i even have my hat on and everything on um it was fun um it was crazy man it was crazy um there's some i know i sent i, I played some clips what happened but did you guys really know this happened Like it was just, it was just on point. Like it was just, it was just crazy. It was just, it was madness. It was complete madness. I mean, any good life is just crazy, man. Like, you know, that's all we do it there though. You know, we always worship every Saturday. You know what I mean? We always get it in. So, you know, you know, as I as I prepare for Rice in the September, you know, it's been, it's been a lot for me. Um, I've been, I had to, you know, be a part of his conference, you know, help with the coordination of his conference, help with the services and, you know, making sure our guests are okay, that they're, you know, that they're, um, everything's all right with them, that their flight's okay, that they're, they're, they have food, that they're okay, you know, that, you know, I have to make sure that they're, you know, always okay. Today, I just, I'm just actually coming from work right now. Um, I work today, I work for the city of Toronto, um, Parks and Recs, um, that was, that's with kids. Next week, I'm going to Seneca College. I'm actually um, doing a lead call or something like that for the call campaign that they have going on. Um, and you know, it just, it's just a lot of work. I literally, every single day is work. And plus, I have to edit this video. It's 1 a.m. 1 in the a.m. in the morning. I have to wake up tomorrow morning just to go to work to Seneca College. I have work in the morning. So right now it's 1 12 as I'm looking at the time. And you know, it's just, it's just a lot of stuff for me to do. But luckily, after 26, I'm no longer working. Um, I only have like one project to do. And then once that project is done, I get all done. It's just straight, soaring, road to rising. You know what I mean? So, but thank you guys for watching my vlog. You know, thank you guys for tuning in, you know, and watching my vlogs, you know, through the whole week. It was a fun week. Um, we enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I had fun. Um, you know, rising. I'm coming September. So you better be prepared for me. I'm planning on doing a lot of workshops there. Hopefully I get to do some of the workshops that I planned um, in the community around me. Um, I'm also hoping, hoping, hoping with all my heart that I can definitely help the new students um, next year. Uh, you know, with just a transition to send to um, Rice University and just to you know inspire them to do more and just to believe in themselves. Um, so Ryerson, please look out for me. I am coming to do work on campus. And everybody, get ready for Frosh Week. I'm gonna be there. It's gonna be crazy. You know what I mean? It's like, I know it's like it's like three three weeks from now, three to four weeks from now. But I'm getting ready from now because it's gonna be lit. Okay. So see you soon. And thank you for watching my blog and happy vlogging. Road to rising. <laughs>